your existing apps can reach more consumers, make more money. All of that is possible and starting to roll out right now. I work in the Windows Store, making sure the store is the best place for developers. We have many new capabilities that we're announcing at Build. The first one is much more engaging store listings. So when customers see your store listing, they can see a video trailer, for example. And the second one is you can upload 50 languages in three minutes. Before, it probably could take you 10 hours. We're also making changes on how apps are beta tested and then released. So we're announcing a couple of new great features. The first one is private beta. Private beta is the ability to release an app or a game to only a specific set of users and nobody else in the world can download it. And then you can use schedule release, which is a brand new feature that allows you precise scheduling. So once your app is released, then you have another things you can do to optimize how your app performs. One of the big things we're announcing is much more robust capability for managing deals and sales. A developer can target, for example, specific users and say, that deal is only for those users. Or you can say, whoever owns this game that I own will get 30% off this other game. You couldn't do that before. And the other big improvement we had is a new, faster way for customers to acquire your app or game. If your app or your game is free, any user without even signing to the store, they'll be able to download the app and game just one click. So in summary, your existing apps can reach to more consumers, make more money. I own uh, developer monetization and promotions. I think the most exciting thing that we're announcing is you know, bringing all this together as a monetization platform, being able to bring the most money for their apps. As of today, we're proud to announce that we have a native SDK to create native ads in your apps. We're going to bring in more and more ad networks. That means more monetization options for developers. We've introduced interstitial ads, which is the full screen ad, a lot of engagement on those ads. And we're soon going to even allow developers to run video-based ads. And we've announced a new type of ad called playable ads. This is where a user can actually play with the ad for about two or three minutes and then decide to install the app. We've seen very high engagement rates on this ad. All of that is possible and starting to roll out right now. My name is Kiran Bangalore. My name is Bernardo Zamora. And I build for Windows.